So these are people that after being diagnosed with a tumor that blocks the lymphatic drainage systems or radiation that causes a change in the ability of those little um, lymphatic um, uh, 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 vessels to move fluid, they become stiff and, and, di and they have difficulty moving that fluid away from the head and neck, the head and neck begins to swell. People often um, uh, experience um, lymphedema or swelling in the region of the uh, neck, so they become very full or they, they have what, what um, is referred to in, in lay person's term as a turkey waddle. And it, it's very, un it can be very uncomfortable, it can be very um, um, uh, unpleasing to look at. Um, many people experience swelling in the region of the face so that their face becomes extremely moon-like. The eyelids, um, the tongue, it, the lips, etc. It is a hugely um, uh, uh, hugely uh, problematic uh, disease for um, function and we often we often disregard that I mean we often um, uh, don't take into account that it's not only cosmetic that's the problem here but it's also function so people will complain of course of of, of problems with cosmesis the way they look but they also will say you know I, I can't swallow well I have trouble um, with my voice it's hoarse um, um, breathing. There have been people who have had laryngectomies, a removal of the larynx where there's a hole in the neck, and, and, and they've ended up in emergency rooms, can't breathe, and nobody knew they had this because the swelling was so significant and blocked the airway. So it has significant functional problems. There are generally two types. Uh, one that affects the external, the face that you can see, and the other one that's internal and isn't really visible until a clinician or a physician actually looks inside the throat and sees that the region of the voice box or the larynx is extremely swollen and people are complaining of discomfort or annoyance. Um, the unfortunate part here is that, as I said in my lecture, it is a common complication um, after head and neck cancer treatment, but it is poorly managed in most cases and it is certainly under-recognized.